Hello students, as you might remember, in the last session, we were talking about good and bad conductors as well as how to test it and we also found out about conductivity of liquids. In this session, we are going to learn about the chemical effects of electric current on conducting liquids. Electric current causes chemical reactions when passed through conducting liquids, such as formation of gas bubbles on electrodes and deposition of metals on electrodes and there might be a change in the solution. These are some of the chemical effects of electric current. The reaction would depend on the nature of solution as well as the electrodes which are taken while the experiment is done. So let us understand this concept with the following activities. For this activity, we will require two carbon rods which can be taken out from a battery or we can use two iron nails, a battery connected with wires, a beaker with distilled water and salt. Connections are made as shown in the diagram. So, we will be taking two clean iron rods and the wires must be wrapped around it. Where after that, we will take a beaker with distilled water or water, then we will be adding a tablespoon of salt. So, while wrapping, we must wrap it properly. Now we will put these two iron nails inside distilled water. Make sure the wires are outside the beaker. Wait for 3 to 4 minutes and observe the electrodes carefully. Are you able to see bubbles on the electrodes? For this activity, we will be using a 9 volt battery, connecting wires and a slice of potato. Connect these things as shown in the diagram. So, we will be connecting the battery to the potato. Now, we will be leaving this setup for a few amount of time. After a few minutes, you can observe greenish blue color in potato around the wire where the positive terminal is connected. This activity can also be used to identify the positive terminal of a battery or cell that has been concealed in a box. In this session, we have learned about the chemical effects of electric current on conducting liquids and I hope you have understood and thoroughly enjoyed this session. In the next session, we will be learning about electroplating. Till then, take care and stay safe. Thank you.